indigenous crops uh, are set to expand their market following the opening of a fresh produce and aggregation hub in Nairobi that will focus on a value addition. addition. The new fresh produce and aggregation hub, which is a project under the public-private partnership model, is expected to enhance the productivity of indigenous crops and vegetables, reduce post-harvest losses, and enhance market access for smallholder farmers. We will be able to provide an opportunity for those who are producing indigenous vegetables in the area of Kisi, Kakamega, and beyond. For this produce to be brought here and packaged in a mark, with a mark of quality that anybody can be able to trace where it came from. You have heard here that there are about 150 farmers who will be producing and will be serviced through the centre. The size of the structure is about 85 square, 85 square metres. Uh, we have a cold room that is 6 uh, metric tons capacity. Um, the value of the investments is slightly more than 10 million shillings, uh, which is uh, you know, as a result of the partnership we have with the university. The facility is expected to serve as a link between farmers and markets. And the focus of, of uh, our current focus is African leafy vegetables. And uh, like you asked, these vegetables are readily available. In terms of the market linkages with the farmers in the two counties, so we are working towards 150 farmers from each county, that is uh, Kakamega uh, 150, Kisi 150, to be supplying their African indigenous vegetables to this aggregation center. Frederick Mwoki for Prime Edition.